Now let's take an example to elaborate on the concept of 3NF and when a relation is in 3NF or not we are going to see with the help of this example. Okay, let's suppose I have a schema which is like this. I have a property schema okay in which I have attributes like property ID I have the district the district where this property is located I have a plot number okay the plot number within the district okay and I have the size what is the size of this property and I have the price what is the price of this property right this is my relation okay I assume that in different districts I would or I could have same plot numbers let's suppose I have a district A and I have a district B then district A would have plot numbers like 1 2 3 similarly district B would have plot numbers like 1 2 3 okay so here I have two candidate keys my candidate keys are a district plot number combination and a just a property ID every property is having a different property ID but we might have two same plot numbers across two different districts right so let me now jot down what are the functional dependencies over here okay I say that the functional dependencies over here are property ID determines district determines plot number determines size and also it determines price okay since this is the primary key this prop this FD is true okay for every candidate key this is going to be true next that we have is my district comma plot number district comma plot number determines property ID and it determines size and it also determines price why because district comma plot number is a candidate key and so a candidate key would determine every other attribute and my third FD over here is size determines price why is this true I assume that the property rates are same across across the whole country okay or whatever this schema is talking about okay I am let's suppose talking about a state and I have many districts in this state and I say property rates are same across the entire state just for the sake of simplicity in that case my price would be what my price would be size into property rate okay and since my property rate is fixed and since my property rate is fixed my price is entirely determined by my size okay so I have these three FDs now let's see if this is in third normal form okay I say if there is a non-trivial FD X to A either X is a super key or A is a prime attribute okay now let's take a look at first okay property ID is the super key so this is good as of now this is in 3NF in second FD district comma plot number to property size and price district comma plot number is a candidate key which means it is a super key even second FD for 